everybody. Good morning. Welcome back to Treadmill Talks. Today is Friday, May the 1st, 2020. This is Treadmill Talk number seven. And on Treadmill Talk number seven, we're going to talk about the big weigh-in. So you all know for the first seven days, Treadmill Talks, I started about seven days ago because I got on punishment with YouTube. I got a copyright strike. And so what I did was I said, until my copyright strike has ended in 30 days, or if it gets lifted, then I'm gonna walk and talk and move and groove, and also encouraging you all to move and groove and walk and talk as well. So, here we are, seven days later. When I first started, I mean, I'm not really trying to, trying to lose weight, but as a result of walking and not sitting around, I'm hoping my weight will go down. I do need to lose a few pounds, or at least, prevent it from going up higher. So, here it is, day number eight, it's been a whole week. When I first started out, I was weighing 252 pounds. Now, seven days later, drum roll please, what do I weigh? I'm at 253 pounds. Womp, 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 what happened? <laughs> My, my, I actually gained a pound, but you know what? Is the glass half full or is the glass half empty? Glass is half full. So here's a glass half full approach. You know what? I gained a pound with me walking, but guess what I would be if I wasn't walking, if I wasn't moving? I'll probably be at 260 by now, all that eating and just sitting around on the couch. So I'm good. I think next week though, for the next seven days, I've been walking, but I'm gonna start changing my eating habits. Oh, I gotta give up something that I've been doing, and that's eating at night. I love to eat before I go to bed, and I know, I know, I know, I know, you should not be doing that, but it just feels so good, and that Patty LaBelle, that Patty, Patty, Patty Pies, boy, that dog on Peach Cobbler, Warm it up a little bit. Put a little ice cream on the side. Oh my gosh. I'm in heaven. But Patty, I gotta leave you alone, girl. You're not my friend anymore. I mean, I like you, but I'm not buying no more Patty Pies. No, I'm not coming in this house because it's a new day. <laughs> so how did y'all do? Uh, first off, as far as the moving, did, is it, it's been a week. Y'all been moving and grooving. One lady told me in the comments, I'm sorry, I forgot your name, but you said, hey, I do enough work around the house as far as uh, housework, and that's my exercise. And that's true. That's a beautiful thing, you know. Uh, other people said they bought a, bought a uh, uh, so I pulled out the treadmill, walking the dog. So just encourage you all to move. Uh, and not just be sitting at home doing nothing, I mean, or watching the TV, but actually move. And then also encourage us and myself, I'm telling myself now, this next week, I'm gonna change my eating habits. The one thing I'm gonna cut out, and I'm not gonna get crazy with it, but the one thing I'm gonna cut out, I'm gonna cut out eating before I go to bed. So let me encourage you all to cut out one thing, um, whatever that may be, and you can put in the comments what you're going to cut out or you can just keep it in your head as long as you're doing something and you're moving toward a better you, a better goal, a better person. So, last video I did was the stripper edition when I talked about that young mother who got her 14-year-old son a stripper and then I also talked about police brutality. So I just want to do some shout outs, look at some comments and um, Beauty for Ashes, thank you for watching. Our beautiful Ashley said that was an example of a young mother trying to be a child's friend, you know? You see a lot of that going on. And uh, it's becoming the norm. Miss Cruz, good to see you. Just Cruz said, Troy, you got me walking and considering purchasing a treadmill. Anywho, on the treadmill purchasing, before this thing all started, I would say you can get some good deals on like Facebook Marketplace or Craigslist. Um, if you want something used, because a lot of times people get these and they don't even touch them. But now with everything that's going on, I don't think you want anything from anybody's house. And uh, and they're not that expensive, depending on what you get with the bells and whistles. So definitely good luck on that, Miss Cruiser. Appreciate you. Christopher Smith, 
Good to see you, sir. Salute 313. Nikki Babe. Hey, Troy, great idea. Trev Mill Talk. I listen to you now when I'm taking my dog for a walk. Oh, that's beautiful, Nikki Babe. Appreciate you. Sharita Hall said, Unreal, simply unreal with these strippers and crappy parents. Racial profile applies to black women and girls as well. It's been more than a few. Right, exactly. I did a video talking about the racial profiling. I had a message to the young boys, but that message applies to the ladies and the girls, young girls as well. And uh, everybody needs to keep that in mind when dealing with the police. This is Callie, C-A-L-L, -L, loved it. Thank you for checking in. Doretha Ricks, good to see you. Uh, she said to each his own, but what is she gonna do for his 16th birthday? Sneak him into the strip club. Mm. Emotion 94602, do y'all check out her channel? Um, she did kind of like a response video and she talks about her experience when first time when she went to a strip club. Emotion 94602, that's, if you look in the comments, uh, let me see, O-M-O-O-S-H-U-N 94602. Oh my gosh, she had me rolling, so check her out. Mississippi girl, Said, as far as the black mother's concerned, she lacks education. You can see that in the comments. Thanks, Mississippi Girl, for your comments. Amon Jordan, salute, 313. All right, y'all. Appreciate y'all watching. I'm going to keep on walking. Make sure y'all moving something. And for this next week, for myself, I'm going to start changing my eating habits. I'm just going to change one habit at a time. I'm going to try to stop eating before I go to bed. Pick one thing, y'all give it a try, all right? Hey, appreciate you so much. Live, love, and laugh. Love yourself, be nice to others, have a nice day, and maybe I might see you around the way. Y'all take care.